hey guys welcome back to another video on Bilal AI universe YouTube channel so today in this video we're gonna talk about another very famous niche which is stick figure animation so as for right now you guys have probably watched so many videos like so many tutorials on how to create stick figure animation mostly you know using Canva but if I'm being honest with you guys uh, you know with Canva if you go ahead and try to create stick figure animation so you know uh, the main problem is that you don't have any kind of animation in Canva like you know the process is a uh, really really simple and you know with Canva you also required uh, like the pay tool in order to get the stick figure animation in Canva so yeah there are so many drawbacks if you go ahead and try this method with Canva but today in this video I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to create stick figure animation without using that paid tool Canva and how you can go ahead and create that very easily with the help of free AI tools like with chat GPT and you know like any other AI video generator that would be all so free in this video so yeah without further ado you guys let's just go ahead and jump right into it all right guys so first of all we're gonna go to chat GPT and I'm gonna write in my very simple prompt I'm gonna uh, like demonstrate everything to chat GPT like I'm going to go ahead and create like a stick figure animation kind of short that you can say a short you know like where there would be a guy he would be a student and he's basically uh, you know doing coding and everything then he's like doing uh, like his work, he gets frustrated, then he goes to the gym. I basically explained the whole story uh, to ChatGPT what I'm looking for. And I specifically said to ChatGPT that, you know, uh, the stick figure animation would be like kind of a line art animation so that I could get exact, uh, you know, what we used to do in Canva, but differently this time because our stick figure animation uh, in this video would be animated, right? It won't be a simple static image. So yeah, that is really, really cool. So then ChatGPT basically got what I'm trying to say. Then it provided me the prompts. So stick figure animation line art white background simple drawing uh, student w wakes up in the bed uh, stretching arms with sleepy eyes so you know uh, for stick figure animation the first this prompt would be same then you can go ahead and you know basically provide uh, your own story uh, to chat GPT uh, like you know whether you want to create image of that or not so you know these all prompts I'm gonna provide you down in the description so you can check that with you as well and you can create your own stick figure animation very easily right so yeah after chat GPT has given us our prompts so then the next step is we need to go ahead and create images out of these prompts so first First of all, I'm going to simply copy my first prompt, simply paste it to a uh, chat GPT one by one. Like you guys know, I have uh, simply attached my prompts over here. So yeah, let me go ahead and show you the images that I created with chat GPT one by one. So here is our first image. So yeah, take a look at this. This looks absolutely perfect. This is our first image of a guy waking up. Then if I go ahead and show you the next one, this guy, the same line art, uh, you know, like a stick animation guy, he's doing his breakfast, then he's working on his laptop, then an error comes, then he submitted his work, then he goes to the gym, he lifts up weights, then he comes back from the gym, then he sleeps, right? You know, so this would be a kind of a short story. So ChatGPT provided us the very exact accurate images. So from here, what we'll do is we're gonna go ahead and animate these images with the help of free AI video tool. And that would be Google VO3 by using Opal, right? So for that, we're gonna go to Google and we're gonna search over here Opal with Google and it's gonna direct us to the homepage of Opal. And if you don't know how to use it, I have provided you, uh, you know, the procedure in our previous video so you can check that out. So in the homepage of Opal with Google, you're gonna go to this motion studio and you're gonna go to simply, uh, you know, click on start motion studio and first of all upload your first image in uh, Opel that you created with chat GPT so I'm gonna go ahead and attach my first image which was this uh, our stick man waking up then after that I'm gonna provide in my prompts so for the prompts uh, with Opel you're gonna go to chat GPT once again simply you know provide the prompt um, that you created with uh, chat GPT so from here I'm gonna simply select this a stick figure uh, student wakes up in bed stretching arms with sleepy eyes so this would be my prompt I'm gonna provide this information to Opel right over here and simply click on submit and similarly you know uh, within just few minutes uh, Opel with Google like our Google VO3 is gonna provide the accurate very exact animation with the help of Opel so I tried you know a uh, stick figure animation with different AI video generators like design.ai but you know the output wasn't very impressive we were getting kind of a you can say lag in our animation because it was very hard for different AI video generators to know like what kind of animation we're looking for so for this particular method I found Opel with Google like Google VO3 a 
perfect option if you want to create your stick figure animation, right? All right, so just like that, within a few minutes, uh, Opal is going to provide us with the animation for our stick figure image. And, you know, let's just go ahead and see how this uh, video turned out, like how it made it for us. So yeah, this is the output it came out with and you guys can see the stick figure animation looks absolutely perfect. There's no lag and you know, it is animated the way it should be. No like, you know, extra animation because we want very subtle, very like 2D kind of animation for that. So it looks really, really good. I'm gonna simply go ahead and download this from here. And similarly, I'm gonna uh, do this, uh, the same method for my every single image one by one, okay? All right, so once all of my videos are done with Opal, as you guys can see right over here, so then uh, we're gonna simply go ahead and edit all of these together, combine them. So for that, I'm gonna use Filmora. You can use any video editor that you like. I'm gonna simply export all of my clips right over here. Simply combine all of these one by one. And you guys might be noticing that I have added some soundtracks right over here. So this is our next step. We need to go ahead and add some dialogues to this as well, just to get, you know, put a little bit of a touch, like a human touch uh, to this stick figure animation. So for that, we're gonna go to uh, 11 labs. We're gonna simply generate some dialogues in 11 lab, like very simple dialogues, like, you know, all right, time for sleep, good night. Before that, I put like, few, what a long day. Haha, <laughs> lifting weights is way more than fun than debugging code. All right, let's hit the gym. So, you know, these kind of small dialogues, I basically created these uh, with the help of ChatGPT itself. I said, you know, uh, so prompts are ready and everything. I want you to go ahead and create me some dialogues, like very short dialogues. Let's just say for the first, it is like, you know, so let's get this day started. And when it's gonna work, uh, he's aggressive, he's seeing error. He's gonna say, why is this error not getting away? So then ChatGPT provided me, you know, short dialogues for every kind of prompt that it provided earlier. So, you know, these uh, prompts I created uh, the voiceover of these with the help of 11 labs and simply you know download this one by one with you so yeah mind you guys this is a complete free method like you know right now you guys can see i'm using 11 labs for absolutely free you don't need any subscription for uh, this complete method this is an entirely free process you guys okay all right so once uh, i have generated some voiceover dialogues with 11 labs i'm gonna simply place them right over here uh you know one by one for my every scene and then if you want you can add some background music if you like but I'm not doing this in this video because of copyright issues so I'm gonna simply explore this video with me and let me show you the final output all right let's get this day started hmm nothing like a good breakfast okay time to focus and get this code done why won't this error go away work submitted yes all right, let's hit the gym. Ha ha, lifting weights is way more fun than debugging code. Proof, what a long day. All right, time for some sleep. Good night. So yeah, there you have it guys. This was the easiest method and a very convenient and functional method to create stick figure animation with the help of ChatGPT, uh, with the help of Google VO3 for absolutely free. Like you have to go for this method if you want to spice up your animation for your stick figure uh, cartoon. And yeah, that's it for today's video, you guys. I hope you liked it and I'll see you in the next one. Until then, take care, bye-bye.